Secure either the crescent face pad or the three-piece face pad to the quick lock by matching up the Velcro strips. Loosen the knobs and release the cam locks to adjust the face rest. Hold the face rest with one hand so you can lock the cam locks with the other hand. Put your face into the pad and relax forward into it until you find a comfortable position where you're looking and facing straight down. When you've found a comfortable and accurate face down position, lock the cam locks in place. They do require a little force to lock and unlock. If you're a little shorter, you may find that moving the face rest back towards you may be the best way to find a comfortable position. The crescent pad is adjustable to accommodate faces of various shapes and sizes. The crescent pad is attached to the face rest platform with Velcro. To remove it, just give it a good tug. Hold it up to your face in such a way that the top of the crescent covers your forehead but not your eyes and the two points of the bottom cradle your chin. The open end of the crescent can be moved close together for smaller faces or further apart for larger ones. Now lean over the platform and settle the crescent pad in place. The three pad face cushion can be used in place of the crescent face cushion when wearing glasses or an eye patch and can be used with any of our face down equipment. Remove the crescent face pad from the face rest platform and replace it with the three pad system. Now remove the two cheek pads and hold them up to your face while wearing your glasses or eye patch. Hold the cheek pad up to your face in a position where they do not interfere with your glasses or eye patch. Lean over the face rest platform and settle the two cheek pads in place until the cushions are again in contact with the Velcro on the face plate. The Velcro attached chest pad can be adjusted to a higher or lower position on the chest plate. Some patients may find it more comfortable to turn the chest pad sideways. The triangular sternum pad can be turned either horizontally or vertically. It can be used for extra support and comfort for larger breasted or barrel chested patients. To adjust the armrest shelf, release the cam lock and the strap. Move the armrest shelf to the correct height for your activity, lock the cam lock first, then adjust the length of the strap. Using these two adjustment points, you can change both the height and the angle of the armrest. You can also easily remove the armrest pad that is attached to the armrest shelf with Velcro strips on the sides. To get off the chair, use the chest pad to brace your hands and push yourself up. Do not use the armrest for this purpose. It's easy to change the angle of the face rest for the sake of comfort. Just make sure that you always maintain an angle that keeps your eyes and face in the prescribed face down position. You can even adjust the face rest so your forehead is a little lower than your chin, as long as it is comfortable for you. Take into consideration the strain on your neck and back as well as the pressure on various parts of your face. If possible, once you have found a comfortable posture, ask a friend to confirm the accuracy of the face down positioning and then tighten the knobs and lock the cams in place. After a while, your position may no longer feel comfortable. For muscle relief, it is recommended you get up at least once an hour to stretch and move around.